Okay, guys, again, straight away the next video. Um, when I was recording the previous video just now about the Giants, I just look I just look at the clock and then I just, oh my god, just now again. <laughs> I look at the clock and it was uh, exactly 11 seconds and I was just about to say that when I looked at the clock just now previously, uh, it was 11 minutes and 10 seconds. And then basically the next moment it hit four times one. And um, that's a video that I wanted to be doing like a month ago. And this is about the, the 111 code. You know. And I 100% can basically, yeah, I don't know how to say it, predict or guarantee or whatnot. I basically know. Because this, th this is the first code people will start seeing the 111 again I saw it again 1 minute and 0 0.1 second oh my god crazy so when you've seen the code this is the first code and I would like to write uh, I would like you to write it in the comments if you've seen it already this is the initiation code this is the first time where it got really really crazy for me you know and and then I heard many people reporting this too. They see they they do see the one one one. It's like I mean it's crazy. It's like you will just pass by and it's like how can you, you know, you will just see it. And the way I interpret this is it's it's the first and it must be a worldwide code that people see and it must be like awakening because this is sort of however you put it, where the matrix breaks down or where the matrix just shows herself, you know, matrix, ma, tricks, you know, she just shows, she just say, hey, yo, I'm doing the tricks, you know, look, I'm doing the tricks. And um, basically th this, to me, as I say, I interpret this as a, as a big awakening in humanity. This is the 111 code. It represents unity, like as I said, the binary language is ones and zeros. Zeros ex don't exist, like the Germans say, from nichts kommt nichts, from nothing comes nothing. There can be no nothing, there can be one there can only be one thing, you know, in this in this term. And um there was a time this was like around this was pretty much yeah, five years ago. Five six years ago, when this started to me, uh, when it started with me, um, I woke up like I, I, three four five six days. I don't remember. In a row, I woke up. I would stand up. I would just go to the clock, which is in in uh, my house, and would always show you know, ten, eleven, one past eleven. And I would see like three times to one. And then I said to myself, one day, because like I was walking by and I was thinking uh, about this 1111 code. And while I was thinking about boom, the clock hit 12. And I live next to the church, exactly next to the church, next to my house. And I was just walking through a dark forest <laughs> and almost reaching the church. And then hit 12. Boy, and I just got so scared because the loud sound of the bell and everything. And I was thinking, like, I mean, I'm thinking about this now, and the clock hits and whatever, uh, the, the, the bell hits, the bell rings. Because the bell rings, you know, it rings, does it ring a bell, you know. So then I'm just like, okay, tomorrow I'm waking up at 11.11, 11, you know. And if the matrix does that, then the matrix, then the matrix has a huge crack, then it's like seriously broken. And that's exactly what happened, except of it wasn't the four times one, it was three times one. But still, it was just like, it was ridiculous. I don't remember what it was, one past 11 or 11 past 10 or, you know, 11, 10, three times one. And then I remember I woke up and I had a really great day. I was super happy. And then uh, I was super happy. I got into my car and I drive and the first uh, number to see the the car that's what's coming was coming um uh from the other direction was one 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 
four times one, three times four, I don't remember. And it was pretty much at the same place. Uh, I met this car. We were passing each other where I just said to myself, I just remember this now, where I said to myself, uh, I want to wake up tomorrow at 11.11. 11. And <coughs> the craziest thing then was uh, the, the most intensified version of this code was um, I was uh, sucking for the past eight years uh, government's cash, you know, not working, nothing, just sucking government's cash. And, uh, yeah, like you can imagine how the fakery goes, right? I have to like this and that and whatever. And I, I remember I just didn't attend this whatever stuff it was and I needed like um, something from a doctor saying that I'm really sick and blah and whatever. So not in order to get some money cut and whatever and whatever. So it was like really under pressure and it was a time where of course I... So anyway. And then I went to the doctor the day. And I just talked to the woman or just the day previously. So I needed this paper from the doctor. And then I arrived at this uh, practice, at the doctor's practice. And then the doors closed. I'm just like, what? The door is closed, I'm completely fucked, what the hell is going on like this? I take my mobile out, I would have made a screenshot, I didn't know back then the the screenshot button that you have to press the home button and the off button to make a screenshot. I take my mobile out and it's 11.11 and my battery is at 11%, so 6 times 1. And then I'm just like, what? I mean, just like, I, I of course didn't know what it even means and whatever, you always interpret things, whatever, and I'm just like, yeah, okay, then it means I don't need the paper. That's what it means. And from there on, I started going like full retard mode. I don't even reply to these guys' letters. For the past three, four years, they invited me this, and then they, you know, just they sent you all those job things and whatever. And the last time they sent to me, like three, four months ago, they sent me a paper. And it's a special type of delivery, um, like where the, where, the, where the post guy signs that it was delivered. This is like when it's really serious with government stuff and like when the cops write to you or, or where's a court case going against you and so on and so on so that you can't say, oh, I didn't get the letter. So they, they sent me this letter this, this, uh, this way. I was like, okay, so the, like you, you seriously want to go against me or what? <laughs> And I still didn't reply. I still didn't give a fuck and nothing. I, because, like, by law, then you have to um, apply for these jobs within three days and you have to report to them that you did or else they cut your money. And as I say, I don't reply to these shits since three, four years now. At least two. I, I don't remember because it's not like you... And nothing ever happened, you know. Nothing ever happened, even though they sent it to me with this letter and they have me by the balls and I still didn't reply, still don't give a fuck. They still didn't cut my money, you know. So yeah, that's kind of the funny stories. And as I say, I predict that everyone is seeing the code till, till some degree. I mean, everyone who watches these kind of videos and whatever and whatever, they they must know about the 111 code. It's the most simple code and everyone sees it. I, I guess, as I say, this is the unity, the initiation, ho however you want it. Whatever you interpret it to be is the right interpretation. This is the way it can be said. This is the way Keys to Cosmic Doorways told me. This is a very nice Facebook page. I asked him something and then he said, this is how it is. Your interpretation is the right interpretation. It's your interpretation, you know, it's pretty much like, you like oranges or you don't like oranges. How can I say that whatever if you don't like oranges, but I do, you know, it's your your thing. Anyway, guys, that's about the 111 code. Um, as I say, please write something down in the comments if you see this code too. And um, yeah, I'll be talking about other different codes which the Matrix sends to us in other videos and so on and so on. Thanks for watching. See you in the next one. Bye.